Hey y'all, this is Brittany and I'm here to do an initial review for the H&J Hair Factory from AliExpress. And if you're more interested in getting specifics on the hair that I ordered, please stay tuned. And as you guys know, it comes in a package like this, either a DHL or UPS. It takes about the same amount of time to come. Let's see what it looks like. And I got five bundles of hair. Five different bundles. I got a 26 inch. I'm going to open in a second. 26 inch. 22 inch. 20 inch. 28. And a 24. No particular order, of course. So let's see what they look like. And I requested that my hair not be jet black. I didn't want jet black hair because if I decide to dye it, that's just way too much lifting. So it's still on the 22 inch and these wefts are constructed rather, you know, they're okay. I've seen better, but the quality for what I paid, I got five bundles and I paid $299, is really nice. And I got the deep wave, more wave because I'm out of full. I know once I wash it and dye it a few times, the waves will will definitely go away. But I really like the wave for this 22 inch. And it's a few gray hairs. And I'm running my hands through the hair. I got one strand so far. So, and I will seal my wefts. I always seal my wefts when I get virgin hair. So again, this is a 22 inch, and the ends are really nice. They're really healthy looking. Usually, I get longer lengths because I like to clip the ends. So for this bundle, I give this bundle an A. So let's look at the rest and see. Reversing a little bit, I have the 20 inch. 20 inch. Let's look at the 20 inch. couple gray hairs but I love the way it's really soft really soft not rough because a lot of these sometimes you get rough hair the wave is not as deep and it's really light on the ends it's like a natural ombre which is cool if that's the look that you're going for they're really light on the ends they're like blonde I like this bundle really nice and soft and I'm 5'8", so this is what a 20 inch right under my bra. I like this bundle. And I'm running my hands through it, and let's see. No shedding from this one. But you know what, I recommend that everyone seal their wefts. You're gonna get shedding. I'm not really, as long as it's not uncontrollable shedding, every real hair shed so I'm not gonna it's not a deal breaker if, if it sheds a little bit I like it. it's really pretty next we have the 24 inch the ends are light on this one I like how all the bundles are similar in color so far and let me show you where it goes me. This is a 24 inch and it's like right by my belly button. 24 inch. I like these bundles. They're just in uniform. Sometimes you can get bundles, they all look different, but these look similar. So I requested. I messaged the person, I forgot her name, I'll include that box below, and I told her I wanted light bundles, I didn't want staticky hair, I didn't want frizzy hair, um, nice ends, it's like you really have to tell them what you want, you're paying for it, you can request what you want, now if they don't give you what you want, then that's grounds, hey I want my money back, hey I want an exchange, 
because they you're paying for something and the least they can do is you know comply to your request so probably didn't need five bundles and this is three already thick wow but you know what I'm the type I like thick weaves I don't like thin weaves and when you take the hair out and change your part or put it back in no matter what it seems thinner so I feel like minimum bleaching if I take care of the hair this should last me a long time so my last virgin hair I bleached about three or four times I got it from lace exclusive last me almost a year 10 months and I'm still I just took it out actually it's still wearable but I just was ready for new hair but so this is the first three so next we have the 26 inch and got a little thinner of course you know the longer the bundle the thinner the bundle and this goes really low I would say right at the beginning of my thigh this is long but again usually when I get my hair done I trim the ends because I hate bad ends but surprisingly these ends are healthy so I might not need to trim that much they're healthy they're really light on the ends this weft it's not the best weft you can't I know you can't tell but it's not the best weft on this 26 inch at all it's still nice but you know you pay attention to little things of course you paid your money you know it's wearable I'm not going to complain because really you get what you pay for. And so far, the quality is nice for what I paid for. Five bundles for three under $300. That's crazy. And this hair should last for a long time. So I really like this 26 inch. I like the waves. And me, the waves can fall because I wand curl my hair and I brush the wands out. I like natural waves. I don't like tight wand curls. And... So, that works for me. And I'm going to co-wash this hair, of course. So, hopefully, conditions it and my waves stay. But like I said, if they go, I'm cool with that. I'm not naive to think they're going to last the whole time. Okay, last but not least is the 28-inch. Now, let's check this boy out. Weft construction is really good. Really nice and soft. I mean, I haven't had any problems with the texture of the hair. I like the luster of the hair. And let's see. Because usually the, the longest length, the ends are kind of, these ends are not the best. But like I said, I'm going to trim about an inch or two. So it'll be a true 26 or maybe about a 27 if I only do one inch. But the ends are a little raggedy. And... Let's see that 26. So they seem the same length, but maybe they're not. Hmm. I don't know. It seems the same length, the 26 and the 28, which is not the best. I don't know. I'll have to measure this later. I don't know where my measuring tape is, but they seem about the same length, which is, you know, y'all could have gave me what I asked for, but I will further investigate before I just jump to conclusions. And so far, I'm satisfied with the hair that I received. Um, the hair is nice. Like I said, I've I've ordered once before from H and J. I only ordered one bundle, and I that was put in with the weave that I had. The hair was from Lace Exclusive. I liked Lace Exclusive, but I decided to do Ali give AliExpress one more try. I've had a bad experience. I think I ordered my first experience. I ordered from a company called Mermaid Hair. The hair was horrible. It was the worst hair I've ever had had beauty supply hair better than that. The hair was staticky, it was dry, it was brittle. I think I only box dyed it. I did like an ombre. It was just bad. So that kind of turned me off on AliExpress altogether. 
So me ordering this hair was kind of like eliminating the middleman because it's a lot of run-of-the-mill companies, which is fine. It's a lot of people who just, just rolled out of bed and decided to do a hair company. And clearly we know where they're getting their hair from. So I decided why well, pay 100, 200 more when I could do it myself, take a chance, review, look at reviews, research, and do it myself. So, so far I'm happy with my purchase. I'm kind of ticked off because it seems like the 26 and the 28 are the same length, but we'll, I'll further look at that. But so far the communication with the company was good. She listened to me when I asked for lighter bundles. Um, the ends are really well. The only ends I probably have problem with is the 28 inch, which usually the longer, who knows, the, the more raggedy. But I ordered a little longer just so I can trim the ends, the ends and I'm satisfied. So I'll leave the link below. But I think H&J is really good hair. I mean, it's a lot of good hair companies on AliExpress, but you just have to find the right one for you. And I'm satisfied. So I will do more videos, more updates on this hair if you guys are interested in updates. I'm going to install it within the week. And I'm just going to let my hair breathe because I've been wearing weed for a while. And I probably will dye it. I'm thinking, I think I, I've done the blonde, um, you know, the blonde ombre. I've done the, you know, the red, the black. The only color I haven't tried, ironically, is brown. I don't just want this kind of brown. I want some highlights. But I'm excited. I really like this color, and I'm excited to see me with this color. So, like I said, if you guys want to see more videos and updates on the H&J Hair Factory, just like and subscribe and I'll get to you as soon as I can. Alright, bye.